Quijano tells us it's a secret society that's still well represented in the halls of Congress. John and Kieran, for all the conspiracy theories about Freemasons, this much is true. They can still be found at the highest levels of American government. From the Capitol to the White House, Freemasons throughout history have freely roamed the halls of power in Washington. Nine of the men who signed the Declaration of Independence were Freemasons, as were more than a dozen U.S. presidents, including George Washington, who famously laid the cornerstone of the Capitol building clad in his ceremonial Masonic apron. These days, Masons can still be found in powerful government positions. Masonic historian Arturo de Hoyas. We have egalitarian ideas. We believe that people should rule themselves, that they should elect their own leaders, that they should be governed by constitutions, have separations of power. Senator Chuck Grassley's a Mason, so is Senator John Tester. But getting someone to chat about it can sometimes be tricky. I'm doing health care. <laughs> Senator Mike Enzi didn't break stride while explaining why he's part of the secretive society. It's a brotherhood built on constructing good men. Yet behind these closed doors... I became a mason in my local lodge in Beckley, West Virginia. Secrets revealed. This was this 32nd degree. Congressman Nick Ray Hall, a Mason for almost four decades, decoded Masonry's most prolific symbol. You may see the compass in the square as symbols of Masonic training. Uh, we live by the square. We're upright individuals. The congressman describes Masonry as a fraternity. He says his mentor and fellow Mason, West Virginia Senator Robert Byrd, nominated him for membership. As a 33rd degree Mason, the highest level in the Scottish Rite of Freemasonry, Congressman Ray Hall acknowledges there are a lot of secrets and codes, but he says they're not sinister. So are you trying to rule the world? I'm, well, let's say no. But if we were, would I tell you? No. Congressman Ray Hall says Freemasonry today is more of a social organization, and despite the prominent positions of some members, is not a forum to discuss power politics. John, Karen? Like and if you him. believe that, I have a book to sell you. <laughs> <laughs> but it's true all over the dollar. You know, what you saw there was you saw the, the unfinished pyramid and the capstone. 